out tonight showing what authorities found during a raid of a Syracuse man's Eastwood home after the riot at the U.S. Capitol building. Matthew Green behind bars tonight for his role in the January 6th attack. A judge calling him a danger to society and keeping him jailed. News Channel Line's Iris St. Moran has been following Green's case. Iris, uh, tell us more about these photos that have surfaced now. Well, Jeff and Christy, the government lays out its case pretty clearly in these in these pictures from the FBI raid on Green's Eastwood home and what they say are photos of him at the Capitol insurrection. This photo shows 33-year-old Matthew Green at the Capitol. It's circled. Green is in a crowd with a blue hoodie, goggles, and a camouflage backpack. This is another photo from that day. Monday in a court hearing, the U.S. attorney said the camouflage backpack was found at his home during a search in mid-January. Green is standing next to his co-defendant, Dominic Pozzola. Both are named in an indictment, which says Pozzola took a riot shield from a Capitol police officer and smashed open a Capitol building window to get in. That's the same shield in this photo. A number of guns were found at a raid at Green's home, including two handguns and an AR-15, which Green did not have a permit for. A significant amount of ammunition was also found in his home. In addition to the ammunition, law enforcement officers also found a gas mask, respirator, and replacement kit at Green's home. The U.S. attorney says that they were all purchased after the Capitol riots. Christy? Iris, thank you.